Hello, Cliff Rawlings here with Sace Company. Let's take a deep dive into the new 8KR and why we feel it's the best remote control grinder on the market today. First, we have to pay homage to the original remote grinder that came out back in 2004, the HTC 950RX. It really was a good first attempt in this category. The 950RX is still very relevant 20 years later in today's market. In fact, we have a few 950s in our service department right now getting maintenance on them for a customer that loves to use them. While HTC got quite a few things right on their first go, there were some issues and weak points that needed to be addressed. Over the last two decades, competitors came out with their variants of remote control grinders to compete against the 950RX. SACE was one of those competitors to do just that. We took this opportunity to look at what every company, including ours, did right and did wrong with each variant of remote control grinders over the last two decades. We feel we did our due diligence by acquiring six competitive remote grinders and evaluate what our customers like and didn't like with each machine. We thoroughly ran all of the grinders through multiple gamuts to show any potential or obvious weak points. Through all of these collective efforts, the SACE 8KR is the end result and what we believe to be the best remote grinder available today. Here are some of the things that our team decided were prerequisites as a predecessor to not only the old SACE remote grinder, but all remote grinders today. Automatic remote channel designation when running multiple grinders on the same project and job site. Non-interference frequencies when working around critical medical equipment, including pacemakers. Onboard charger for remote batteries while grinding. A single 110 volt source to charge the transport and spare remote batteries while in storage. Repeatable results with all pertinent info on screen while grinding, giving each operator the ability to have consistent results from person to person. The ability to grind up a 15 degree concrete ramp and parking garages, as well as in transport mode to load in trailers. We achieved as high as 17 degree angle when we field tested this. A transport wheel that won't get left on the job site or take up valuable real estate in the trailer or box truck. Smooth remote operation that is intuitive and natural. A more robust engagement system for drive wheels. Tougher swing weight pins. A simple yet stronger handle pivot and pin option. As many off the shelf parts for common wear parts. Tires that won't puncture, flat spot, or blow out with gel yet has the traction needed to go up wet ramps if needed. Unfortunately or fortunately, the AKR project kicked off right after COVID. So we encountered multiple supply chain issues, which slowed the project down considerably. This also gave us more time to properly vet the prototypes in the field. To the point we had five working prototypes out in the field with contractors testing all the failure points and giving us the time to properly address these issues and fine tune the controls and features. Because of this, we believe the AKR is properly field tested and more than ready for job site use. Now let's dive into the details.